Hey gang, I'm back here with uh, our turn. As you can see, we've moved from uh, 7 a.m. to about 8 a.m. up here on the right-hand side of the screen. And the here's what's transpired. There, there were some hinds up here that took out uh, an M1. They migrated this way, and we managed to knock off one or two of them. Similarly, in the south, these hinds pulled back uh, from the center of the map a little bit after knocking out two of my Apaches. And this platoon of tanks here has not moved in, in the south at all. It's, uh, I think it may end up actually trying to be a screening force here, which means we may be looking at the full thrust coming up right up M279 as we have probably expected. Uh, I'm going to use my last pair of Apaches to soften this force up a little bit. And that would then, uh, if this is indeed a screening force and there's nothing else back along here, I can then bring these two platoons forward to try and take them out and potentially either move some reinforcements through this way and come around behind them, or uh, at the very least know that this is not uh, the approach uh, that they are planning on taking and trying to swamp me with just uh, two platoons. Up in the north, uh, I didn't realize, I thought this was uh, more BRDMs, but I thought they were sitting back here we knocked out the spigot-based BRDMs here. You can see the little red X's there. There's three or four losses there. And we knocked out some tanks on the way. They put some RD on this M1 here. But these tanks just barreled up the road, bumped right into my uh, M150 here. And then these two platoons of tanks hopped in and uh, started firing pretty, pretty aggressively. I'm up on a, a rise here, so I've got a line of sight down into that little valley, and that's pretty nice. These guys uh, put some paint on, and as did these. So it was a good all-round cross-field fire. Only concern is this unit here doesn't have awesome uh, lines of sight. You know, it can see here, but its range, uh, according to this anyway, max fire area is, is just here. So that may not be super efficient uh, or effective location to be in. And we're probably gonna have to move them up. Moving them up puts, puts them in, uh, in harm's way though, right? Anyway, uh, these guys over here, uh, have uh, uh, these are platoons of infant mechanized infantry by the looks of it and some Bradley fighting vehicles they have good range I may be able to once I soften up this force here maybe able to trade out one of these units for one of these platoons of tanks here and uh, and, and let them uh, meander up to the top here so that's kind of what's going on uh, it's 0800 on July 21st and the visible range now is out to 5,700 meters up from 500 meters so the weather is bouncing around a fair bit. Uh, logically it's going it was at 500 then it went to 15 then to 2,500 and now it's out to 5,700 so it's kind of replicating the, the sun burning off the early morning fog in West Germany. That's the story. We'll leave it at that for now.